<laughs> I just wanted to say it's pretty simple. <laughs> Welcome back to my daily grind, create yourself, that's what it's all about, one day, one step in the right direction. I'm Chris and I'm only here to show you if I can do it, then you can do it as well. It is Sunday and I'm slowly getting better, I'm feeling way better, but I'm still sounding pretty ridiculous. And the plan for today is to give you guys a little update on the Karambit situation, I get asked a lot Will there be more tutorials? Yes, there will be more tutorials and this video will be a short teaser and a review of my collection so far. So let's get to it. So that's my collection or at least a part of it that I won't sell. Well, except for these, I, I won't sell them, but I'm probably going to destroy one of them. Let's start with the version you all know. This is the Trainer Knife version 1, the knife which I filmed the tutorials with. That's the same one in white. And a few weeks ago, I came up with a new version and that's the Trainer Knife version 2 in black, white and transparent. Yeah, and as you can see, it's basically, well, let's take this. It's pretty much the same design. The ring has the same diameter, but I rounded off the tip. So this is way more comfortable. This thing is also a pain in the ass, to be honest. Remove that. And the center of gravity is also slightly different. It's hard to say which I like more. I'd probably say this one. And these are my newest Bali songs. They are cheap CSGO replicas from China, of course. This is the Crimson Web design. I like this design the most. Well, the fade is also pretty nice, but I chose this design. Mm, this might also be an epic thumbnail. I plan on filming at least two more waves of tutorials and I will film them probably with the second version of my trainer knife. I'm also going to review this one. I'm also going to throw this one. So this is the first wave. I plan on doing seven videos. After the Karambit week, I will continue with the Assassin's Creed. Storyline, I will review my newest hoodie and also tailor my old ones. Yeah, this will be pretty much a tailoring week. And after that comes another Karambit week with at least nine more videos. And now I will show you all the new moves I will be teaching you in the second and third wave of my tutorial series. Let's do this. The first tutorial will be the figure of eight in detail because this tutorial seems to confuse a lot of guys. And I have to be honest, this wasn't, you know, a full tutorial. I'm not too proud of that, so I'll definitely come up with a more polished version of that. The second tutorial will be a reverse figure of eight, and you can also combine them to a figure of eight boomerang. <laughs> yeah, and these three tutorials, they will basically be an add-on to the first wave. Second wave, of course, will start with Karambit Basics 2, and in this wave it's all about grip change. For example, from this grip to this grip, and of course, in a like tricking like fashion yeah. you can also oh, go to the never mind <laughs> second tutorial of the second wave will be an advanced grip change uh, tutorial oh my god i completely forgot how i oh third tutorial will be a figure of eight grip cha change oh jeez this is kind of it will get pretty difficult, to be honest. Right, you see? Damn, son! <laughs> and the fourth video of the second wave will be a figure... Figure of eight extension. Or extended. Yes! The fifth one will be a thumb roll. Right, saw that in a few videos. <laughs> I just wanted to say it's pretty simple. <laughs> and the third wave will start off with a review. Cheap Karambit knives from China, is it worth it? Well, are they worth it? Should you buy them, should you not? How to buy them, this might be a separate video. The third video will probably be about safety tips because, well, you, you don't want to mess with a real Karambit. The fourth video will be a comparison. I got a lot of comments and they're concerned about the weight. Some of them went as far as you can't do the same tricks with a real knife because it has way more weight to it. Are you serious? It is the same trick, it just moves slower. All right, so I will definitely, <laughs> I will get to that concern. And then of course, Karambit Basics 3, which will, this will be, you know, the start for the third wave. And in this basics, it's all about, you know, the real knives, the dangers of them, and again, the difference 
to a trainer version. That's as far as I planned. The rest is not planned. <laughs> what I do know though is that I'm going to destroy one of them, do a destruction test, I will also throw them, make a separate video. <laughs> carry with throwing, well, this will be a fun video, of course. And after that I'm also going to do more just for fun videos, like things to flip instead of a carrying bit. I want to do a just for fun gun flipping video. I might even call it gun flipping basics. I also want to do a scissor flipping basics uh, tutorial. I am definitely looking forward to that. And now, since it is Sunday, let's review the week. Crypt and get well, I scripted a few videos, I'm not, well, I'm... This is so stupid, the way I'm sounding, it sounds so ridiculous. I'm feeling so weird and awkward, I just can't do it. The Walking Dead premiere was pretty freaking epic though. That was literally sick. Little progress on the punching bag project and yeah, and I didn't get any videos done. I would say maybe 10 hours main quests, around 10 hours side quests. 13 hours work though, 0 hours university, totals to 33 hours, 0, 6. One goal completed for the hell of it, 106 hours to go and I will see you in my next tomorrow!